Hey guys, welcome back, or if you're new here, welcome. My name is Amanda, and I thought that it would be really fun to do a week-long series of some fall fashion favorites. So every day this week, from Monday through Friday, I'm gonna have a new video for you guys that's gonna be some kind of a fall favorite. I thought this would just be a really fun series to do for fall. There's so many things I love about fall fashion. I just thought I would incorporate a few videos for a fun little series this week. And I'll also create a playlist and link it down below and add the videos each day to that so you can just look at that playlist if you want to see any of the other videos so today is going to be day one and i'm going to be starting it off with my favorite fall sweaters these are some of my favorite sweaters that i'm so excited to start wearing it's not quite warm enough here in tennessee to start wearing these but i'm so excited about these now there are some that i have bought like last year, but they are still available because they're from Amazon. So I have 15 sweaters that I want to share with you. So let's just go ahead and get started with part one of this fall fashion favorites week with the favorite sweaters. So the first one I want to start off with is the one that I'm wearing right now. This one comes from Amazon and I did pick this up a couple of months ago and it's really comparable and a great dupe for the Madewell sweater that I picked up from the Nordstrom anniversary sale. That one's actually going to be included in this fall favorites as well. But I wanted to show you both of those so you can see both of them and see how they do compare. But this one is a little bit more affordable from Amazon and it comes in a ton of different colors. This one is so nice. It has that shaker stitch material and this is not cuffed. I have to cuff mine because the sleeves are so long on me in most of my sweaters. So this is not a sewn in cuff or anything like that. It has this great V neck. You can see that it does have these side slits and it is long in the back. I'm gonna go ahead and just untuck this, but I wanted to show you first of all, how this looks with a front tuck. And then you can see the length of it. And then here's the side view. You can see that the back is a little bit longer than the front is. And it does have these really nice side slits. So this is really great because it does cover the bottom area. So this is really good to wear with leggings. And it covers the front area too. So this is really good to wear with those faux leather leggings you might have or some regular fleece leggings. But I love this one. This does run true to size. I did order this in a medium. This is just a little bit softer than the Madewell sweater that I was talking about, but I will be showing that one in just a few minutes too because that is one of my favorites. But this is such a great sweater. I love all the color choices that it has and it's a really nice fit and it's great that you do have the option that if you want to, you can front tuck it and wear it with jeans or you could wear it with leggings if you wanted to just kind of leave it out like that because it's a great tunic length. So next up is gonna be this sweater from Madewell. So this is the one that's a little bit pricier than the very first sweater that I showed you that I said is a really great date for the Madewell one. So this is it. So I wanted to show them one after the other so you could kind of see the difference. They are very similar. Now the sleeves are a little bit shorter. I don't have these cuffed at all. So these fit a little bit better in the arms for me. Does have, have that same v-neck, the same buttons, and that same shaker stitch material. This one's not as soft as the first one. I love the color that I picked this one up in, in this camel color, because I think it's a really great neutral, and I love the length of this. Now, this one's not as long as the first one that I showed you. If you don't like your front showing and leggings, you definitely can't wear this with the leggings. It is a little bit longer in the back, where it will cover the bottom area, but it does not cover the front. It has those same slits. This is seriously so comparable to that first one that I showed you. This one's a great one. I love this one. This one's also a little bit of a thinner material than the very first one, but both of these are great and they run true to size. Number three is this gorgeous, vibrant sweater. So I picked this up from a Walmart. I think it's from the Scoop line. This is such a good sweater, you guys. It is almost has like a heathered look to it, so you can kind of see this material. This is such a vibrant color. It does come in two other colors, I think, maybe even three other colors, but I love the balloon sleeves that are on this one, and it's got that great v-neck, and then it also has a little bit of zigzag stitching, so you can kind of see the stitching's a little bit different here, so it just makes it a little bit more interesting, and then you can see the length in the back is a little bit longer than it is in the front, but I love the color of this. I thought it was just so great, so vibrant. So this is another good one, and I cannot st wait to start wearing this one. It's nice and soft, and it does run true to size, so I did get this in my, my normal size medium, and I just love this sweater, you guys. It is super affordable. Right now, it's actually on sale at Walmart at a clearance price, so this is just a great one. Also, to pick up if you really want a good, vibrant color for fall, 
This one's a good one. Next up is this wonderfully soft sweater. So I just picked this up from Maurice's. I actually went into the store. I usually shop online, but I actually went into the store. And when I felt this one, I actually had to get this in another color. So I actually picked it up in the cream color as well. This is more of your darker gray. And they also had it in a wine color. It has these cute little buttons on the bottom and it is one of your crew necks. When I tell you this is soft, this is so incredibly soft. They're more of a lighter weight sweater, so they're great if you want to layer over top of these. If you want to throw a cardigan for even more warmth, or if you want to throw a blazer over this, you can because this is not a real chunky sweater. I think it's a great one, more of your lightweight if you have milder falls and winter. And it's also great for transitioning as well because it's really nice and lightweight. But when I tell you this is soft, it feels so nice, you guys. I love the crew neck for the layering aspect. So I do have this front text so you can see how long it is. And I'll just go ahead and untuck it so you can see. It has this circle hem and it's a little bit shorter in the front. It does cover the bottom area and it also covers the front. So if you did want to wear this with leggings, you could also do that. But I think this is such a great one, guys, that I had to pick it up in the cream color as well. And it does run true to size. I did order it in my normal size of medium. Next up is this gorgeous sweater that I picked up from Loft. It is in this really pretty green color, but I do think it comes in two other colors. Again, it's that really great shaker stitch knitting. I love a shaker stitch sweater. I think it's just got the right amount of weight and it feels so luxurious and it looks expensive. There's just something about that kind of stitching that I absolutely love. So it is a great crew neck with this ribbing detail up at the top. It also has ribbing detail at the bottom. I just kind of have it like rolled under for just a little bit of a better fit. And then the sleeves are so cute with this open stitch detail. So you can see all of this detail that is on the sleeves. It is so nice. And then it does have a really nice band. So even though these are a little bit long for me, I can kind of just tuck them over this and it still looks really, really nice. So I love the color of this one and it does run true to size. I did order it in a medium. So you can also see the side view. This one's the same in the front as it is in the back. I just think that this is a really great sweater with all of this pretty detail on the sleeves. Now we have this one, again from Walmart. It's from the Free Assembly line. Again, it's another great shaker stitch material, and it has a great V-neck with this trim on here. So I love this bubblegum pink color with the wine color as an accent. I think these two colors just look so pretty together. I just love the weight and the feel, the oversizedness of this sweater. I think it's a really good one, so you can see how it is in the front and in the back. And then if I kind of just like roll it down, you can see that it is like a tunic length. So if you did want to wear this with leggings, you could do that as well. But you can see it has the color down at the bottom around the collar and also at the sleeves at the bottom of the sleeves as well so this one's a super comfortable just a really great quality sweater it's really affordable this one is on a clearance sale as well at walmart or it's on a rollback one of the two and it's just a great deal great quality and it does run true to size up next is this great sweater. It comes from Maurice's as well. I did just pick this one up. This is more of a lightweight material. It has a great circle hem on here. And then you can see that it has that waffle knit detail. And it also has some like stitching on the sleeves as well. It's a great cow neck top. It's such a lightweight top, so it's great for transitioning. So this is a really nice and loose fit. So you can see how loose it is. It's kind of like a swing style fit. I love this one. I actually bought this to wear under a vest because I love to wear some kind of mock neck or cow neck under vest. So this is just so soft. This is a really nice fabric. And this comes in, I think, three or four other colors. I got this one just for a more neutral look so I could pop some other vests over top of this. But of course you can wear this by itself. So this is a really good one too. And I ordered it true to size in my normal size medium. Here's another good choice from Walmart. I got some really good sweaters from Walmart this year. I think they are really doing a fabulous job with the quality of their clothing. This one is from the Free Assembly line. So I think this is the second sweater that I've showed you from the Free Assembly line. I love this one. I got it in the navy color, but it does come in two, I think, two different colors. It has silver zipper on here, so it's one of your quarter zips, the shaker stitch material, and then you can see it has like a little bit of a balloon sleeve. It also has like almost like a shawl collar. So you could actually, if you zip this all the way up, then you can see you kind of have like this little shawl collar kind of deal going on. It does run true to size because I did get it in the medium, but I loved it in the navy color. I just think it looks really good with this color wash jeans as well with a pair of tall boots and this is just a fabulous look. But I love this one so much. It's so comfortable. It feels really nice. 
and it feels like it's a great quality and it just has that expensive look to it. Next up is another sweater that I picked up from the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale earlier this year. This one's from Caslon. It's super soft and comfortable. I loved this rust color. It did come in three or four other colors. I'm not sure what colors are still available in certain sizes, but there is a lot available still in this sweater. But I love how soft it is, and you can kind of see it has a marled look, a heathered look to this. So that's really nice, and it has this really great ribbing detail right here a v-neck and then it has this seam that goes down the middle the back is kind of almost like a v-neck as well it has a little slight v-neck to this one but then you can see the length of this one is also going to cover your bottom so you can wear it with leggings if you want to i do have this just front tucked for you to see how it looks but then i will untuck it and then you can see it does cover the front as well so this is a great one to wear with those faux leather or those faux suede leggings and this does run true size i did order it in my normal size medium love the color of this one and this is more of your lighter weight material, but it's super soft. And I just love the heathery look to it. The next sweater is this beautiful purple color. Now, this is another one that I picked up from the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. Again, the sleeves are a little bit too long, but I just kind of wanted to show you how they looked. I would normally cut these up. This one, again, has that really great heathered look to it. So, this is purple, but it looks like it has burgundies through it. So, it's really pretty, and it has this great ribbed detail it's a nice crew neck now this one i did size down to a small but it's not real boxy so you could probably stay true to size on this one in hindsight just for a little bit more of a boxier look i probably should have stayed with my true size but i did order down to a small in this one when i picked this up from the nordstrom anniversary sale it was 14.99 you guys so it was such a great deal it's so nice and soft i just love this it's from the bp brand so it's one of those great quality ones that you can wear year after year. So this just happens to be the one that I picked up this year that I absolutely love in this purple color, but there are definitely other colors in this one, but I just love the purple. And this is such a nice one, you guys. It's more of your medium weight material and it's just gonna be really nice and warm and it's super soft as well. I love everything about this next sweater. Again, this is one that I picked up from the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. This is from Treasure and Bond. I sized down to a small in this one as well because it does have more of an oversized fit. So you can see I have lots of room in this sweater and I did size down one in this. It is so soft. So I have this in the black. I also have it in cream as well. The cream one is the first one that I picked up and I just loved the softness of it and just how it looked and how comfortable it was. It was such a great deal that I picked it up in the black as well. You cannot go wrong with the cream sweater and a black sweater. And this one is just so nice and comfortable. It feels really good. I love this one. And like I said, I did size down in this one, but still have plenty of room in it. It has this really great crew neck. This is so comfortable, you guys. And so this is the length of it. You can see the side view as well. So it is the same front to back. Love this, you guys. I have it in two different colors. This is another great soft sweater. This one comes from Loft. It has a really nice V-neck. It's more of your Henley style. And it does have functioning buttons though. So if you want to unbutton this, it is a functioning button. It's got this really great rib detail. And then you have this band at the sleeves. This is so nice. It's soft and I love this color. That is what I love most about this is the color of this one. It's more of a dusty rose. This does come in I think two or three other colors and it does run true to size because I did get it in a medium so you see that I have it front tucked and then you can see the back of it doesn't actually cover the bottom area and so I'll just untuck this you can see the length of this one and then the side view it does have slits on the side this is such a pretty color it feels really nice and soft and I just love the neckline of it and the button detail on this as well and the ribbing detail is so nice and I don't know if you can see this or not but it has like an open stitch right here and then it has a diagonal seam right here. So it kind of looks a little bit more flattering, kind of like pulls your eye in on this one. So I just love this sweater. It's a really good one. I promise this is the last one that I'm going to tell you I picked up from the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. But this one is from Caslon, and this one is a good one too. Again, it's got that heathered look, but it's this beautiful pink color with, I don't know, this it almost looks like purple, kind of like marled throughout it. Great ribbing detail on the sleeves also this really nice crew neck now this is more of your medium weight sweater this runs true to size i did order this in a size medium and it has lots of room in here so even if you wanted a more fitted look you could definitely size down so let me just roll this down so you can see the length of this one again doesn't really cover the bottom area so i wouldn't feel comfortable with leggings on this one but i think this is such a nice one it's so soft it's just a really good sweater you guys 
Next up is this sweater, and it's actually a sweater that I picked up last year. So I have worn this so much with some faux leather leggings. I've worn them with the dupes that I purchased from Amazon, as well as the Spanx that had the moto style to them. Love this sweater, and I loved the color of this one. So I did pick it up in red, but as with most things from Amazon, this does come in a ton of other colors. It's more of your popcorn style sweater. So you can kind of see the texture of this one. It's got a great crew neck and it is a tunic one. So like I said, I have worn this so much with leggings. You can see it has some slits on the sides, but it does cover the front and the back. Actually right now I have a pair of pull-on jeans. So this looks really good with anything pull-on style. It's just a great sweater. I love this one. So I did order this in a medium, so it does run true to size. But like I said, I ordered this last year. So it's held up really well. It's held up through washes and wears. And I just think that it's held its shape really nicely. The quality is just really good on this one. And they do still have them available in lots of different colors. Again, for this sweater, this is one that I picked up last year from Amazon, but it's still available. It's from the Good Threads brand. So it's from one of the in-house Amazon brands. I love this and the weight of this one and the material again is that shaker stitch material. This has burgundy with like some purples going throughout. It has a really nice marled look to it. This one is such a good one. I love it. It has a little bit of a mock neck and it's really thick. It's not a chunky one. As you can see, I have lots of room, so it's really nice and loose. It's not real constricting or anything. I think this looks really good. I was so excited about this last year when I picked it up. I've worn this with black pants. I've also worn this with black jeans and I've worn it with regular jeans. I absolutely love this. I think it's such a great one. It's not tunic length or anything, so you can't wear it with leggings, but it's got a really nice like swing style to it. I love that about it. It's just a really good one. It's a great medium to a heavier weight and I don't have to cut the sleeves, so that's really nice. I really like this marled look, but then they have some that are just a one color. They don't have any heathering or marling look to it, but this one I just loved. I fell in love with this one. I think they have another one that has this kind of effect, which is a black and a gray, like a light gray, but then the other ones are just one solid color, but these are so good. I love these and they're really affordable. I think when I picked it up, it was like $24 or something like that. So it's a really great sweater for under $25, but I hate to tell you the price of something on Amazon because it just changes depending on your size sometimes or the color that you get or if it's really popular, then it'll go up in price as well. And it does run true to size because I did pick this one up in a medium as well. All right, guys, that's going to be part one of Fall Fashion Favorites Week. And these were all of the sweaters that I've picked up. Most of them this year, but a couple of them from last year that I've just really loved. These two that I picked up from last year, I was so excited to pull them out of my closet and start figuring out what kind of outfits I was going to wear those with. And then the new ones that I picked up this year, they're just so good. A lot of those do come from the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale. And they are back on sale now. So they were at a really good price back in July when we bought them, but now they are discounted as well. So check those out because they might not be as expensive as you think. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will put a playlist down below for all of the videos this week. So I'm going to have four more videos coming for this week for the fall fashion favorites week. So stay tuned for tomorrow's video. And I would love to have you consider hitting that subscribe button so that you don't miss out on any of these great fall videos. I hope to see you in my next video. Until then, I hope you have a wonderful day.